Good morning to you on this Saturday. I'm Lynn Smith and thank you for spending part of your day with us here on Weekend Express. We begin this morning with the U.S. Marine Corps launching a task force to investigate the subculture that led to the posting of explicit photos of female Marines on the web. Earlier, just within the last few hours, police in the town of Essen shut down a large shopping mall because of a terror threat. Now, police made the move after what they say were, quote, concrete indications of a possible terror attack. So we're watching this situation. As we get any new developments, we'll bring it to you right here on Weekend Express. But first, Trump officials say his administration and transition team were aware that former National Security Advisor Michael Flynn had dealings with a Turkish-owned company prior to his appointment. The White House does say that the president himself was unaware of those ties until this week. CNN's Jessica Schneider reports. Administrations have replaced the U.S. attorneys within a year or two of taking office. Pope Francis appears to be opening the door to allowing married priests to serve in the Catholic Church. This was big. Okay, do you want the good news or the bad news first? I always like to start with the good news. The economy is doing better, but here's the bad news. Interest rates may go up as a result. So money expert Jen Westhoven is here. She has her Westhoven watch list, and of course, this is a big one. Good morning. Yeah. And this is exactly why, for example, people say watch out for just yeah. the ball. But it has been eight years old, mm -hmm. doesn't sound yeah. fair, basically almost as a protest. Thank you Red so much, Jen. That little girl, Abriana, I love it. Thank you so much. So, we are making it our mission to help you and your family get more sleep. We all need it, right? I talked to Sanjay Gupta first about why it's so important for babies to get good sleep early on. The American Academy of Sleep Medicine says full with their children waking up every three hours, no matter what they do. You project. We've all been there. <laughs> <laughs> I've been there as well. Yeah. As humans, as we start to develop, we're starting to actually learn our own circadian rhythms, our own stages of sleep as well. I heard, and some of the best advice I ever received was you have to teach your child to sleep. I mean, you have to let them learn to fall asleep yeah. themselves, so put them to bed awake. Yes, when they're when not actually just using that after they're already asleep, having slept somewhere else, because that's what they become used to falling asleep in that. Why is it so important for babies at the youngest age to get that big chunk that's recommended? Well, you know, th there, there are real physiological reasons, first of all, you know, heart, but you know, it can, it can affect their growth. So we've seen an increase in things like ADD and sensory processing disorder and our children not getting enough sleep. Yeah. Is there medical evidence that has linked the two of those? Yeah, I, I, I think that what the evidence that the, you know, a child seemed to have much in the way of symptoms, but then with the lack of sleep, what they sleep hygiene for children. <laughs> we hear about it for adults, you know, don't look at your device, uh, you know, get into bed at a similar time. Yep. Is it is it the same for adults yeah. as it is for children? And take us through what some of those are. Yeah, it's, it's, it's... A rested child is also a rested family, rested parents, in which everyone is more happy. It's a joyous experience, <laughs> you know. It can happen. Together, but not many run three veterinary clinics together. Watch on Nat Geo Wild. Good morning, thanks for being morning. with us. Thank you. You know, your show, Love and Vets, you fall in love as much with the animals as you do with the two of you. I've had some time to get to know you. Is this program more about the animals or your relationship in working together? I think it's a good mix. In the meantime, you've welcomed cameras to showcase all of that. First, just separate from the show itself. What's that like? It's been wow. fun. Oh, okay. that, was, that was awkward. <laughs> They're not watching the show when and that actually like, happens. Mental note, don't show that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So it's, it's, it's been interesting. Yeah. yeah. Have you yeah. had fun doing I mean, this is a new sort of world for you as well. The, yeah. Oh, yeah. The story. We've spent about 15 <laughs> minutes hearing about them. I'm not going to spoil that for you if you can tune in and watch the two of you. It's such a pleasure <laughs> to Thank have you, you with much. me, Dr. Will. Well, that does it for us today here at Weekend Express. We hope to see you back here tomorrow starting at 7 a.m. Eastern time. Don't forget, move your clocks ahead one hour tonight. Coming up next, Forensic files hope you have a